Hey everybody, welcome back to another reaction video. Hope you're doing well. My name is Todd. This is from the animatic of Heather's Me Inside of Me. This is requested by a Patreon subscriber. You too can join the Patreon link down below. Description will get you there. Or like the video if you like it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Hit that notification bell. That way you know when videos post immediately. And you can come check them out. And let's go. Think long and hard. Conjure her up in your mind. What would she say? What's her final statement to a cold, uncaring planet? Dear world, believe it or not, I knew about fear. I knew the way loneliness stung. I hid behind smiles and crazy hot clothes. I learned to kiss boys with my tongue. That's good. But oh, <laughs> the world, it held me down. I Weighed like a concrete prom queen crown. No one thinks a pretty girl has feelings. No one gets her insecurity. I am more than shoulder pads and makeup. No one sees the me inside of me. Jesus, you're making me sound like air supply. Keep going. This has to be good enough to fool the cops. Whoa! Is it murder? No, look. Here's a suicide note. They couldn't see past my rock star mystique. They wouldn't dare look in my eyes. But just underneath was a terrified girl who clings to her pillow and cries. My looks were just like prison bars. They've left me a myriad of scars. Myriad? Nice. No one thinks a pretty girl has substance. That's the curse of popularity. popularity. I am more than just a source of hand jobs. <laughs> no one sees the me inside of me. <laughs> Heather Chandler's not your everyday suicide. You should cancel classes. No way, coach. I send the kids home before lunch, and the switchboard will light up like a Christmas tree. Our children are dying! I suggest we get everyone into the cafeteria and just talk and feel together. Thank you, Miss Fleming. Call me when the shuttle lands. <laughs> I'm telling you, we all misjudged Heather Chandler. This is the loveliest suicide note I've ever read. Box up my clothing for goodwill. How many of those has she read? More my Nordic track. Donate my car to crippled kids or to those ghetto moms on crack. Give them my hats and my CDs, my pumps, my flats, my three TVs. No one thinks a pretty girl has feelings, but I peek for all I fail to be. I fail to be. Maybe I can help the world by leaving. Maybe that's the me inside of me. The hell! Long weekend for everybody! <laughs> and not so fast, kids! They're refueling the buses, which gives us a solid half hour of healing. Now, I have mimeographed copies of the suicide notes, so you all can feel Heather's anguish. I never knew about her pain. Go on. Her life had hit a rocky patch. Feel. Deep down, she wasn't cruel or vain. Feel. She didn't mean to be a snatch. Veronica, you're very quiet. What's on your mind? Uh, maybe Heather realized that in order to be happy, she had to give up her power. And that the only way to do that was death. My god. Look what we've done, we're breaking through. Heather wouldn't be so proud of you. No one thinks a pretty girl can touch you. Oh Heather touching god. me. But she's made us better than
Pretty people stay winning, don't they? Separated. She's the horse I never got for Christmas. Heather sees on me inside of me. Heather is the me inside of me. Inside of us. Unbelievable. Link down below in the description for the original video go throw out some love you know there's a lot of truth to those words you know pretty people it's a double-edged sword obviously there's more benefits than negatives prettier people are statistically going to earn more money going to get hired first going to i don't know have more success in interpersonal relationships it's unbelievable how human beings or you know even the animal world looks matter a lot a lot it's not the full deal you got to actually have a personality and you know be a human being after that but it gets your foot in the door that's for sure but yeah constantly being seen as just visually pretty and therefore you're worth more or therefore you think this way or therefore you you know feel this way about certain things it's just it's very surface level I'm sure that gets very annoying to those that happen to be super pretty or whatever. And there is a threshold for being pretty looking where you just feel like everybody only sees that and you're just constantly bombarded. Now, obviously, there's another aspect of that, and I'd rather be constantly bombarded than never bombarded. That being said, just like, you know, rich people, poor people, celebrities, normal folk, we all have our problems, we all have our demons, we all have, you know, issues. And being pretty kind of covers them up a lot of the time. So people get blinded by the pretty, and they don't realize, oh, there's someone suffering in <laughs> behind that prettiness. Do you suffer from being too pretty? Is that your problem? Let me know down below in the comments. <laughs> Excellently done animatic. I've really enjoyed these. It's really... um Something I haven't really seen before, but I actually really like it. It's simplistic, but it's also still very descriptive. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. Link down below in the description for the Patreon. Thanks so much for subscribing to the channel. I appreciate that as well. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.